Hayo machache, I am urging the government representatives, they tell the public, the moment Oparanya handed over health to His Excellency Uhuru Mikai Kinyata, and the moment His Excellency Uhuru Mikai Kinyata, a president I love much, was misled by corrupt cartels, because Oparanya has been bought by CPF. Oparanya is enjoying the money from CPF. He, he was, what was Jose Akili doing in, in COG when Oparanya was being elected? What was he doing there? You saw him on TV walking out of COG because he had gone to bribe him. So he has already been bought. But let me tell Oparany, Tutoswakana na wewe. And we want audit. We want audit. Wakuzi oe. Wakuzi ya. We want lifestyle audit of all governors. Those who served first term. Some of them have built houses of 60 million. Misharayao ya miyakaine wezifika 60 million. Some of them were menunuwa ma hotel kula Australia. They don't. They think we don't know. Some of them have built uh, ma hotel zata kaka meka ata wabi na tunajua. Kwa hivyo tunataka lifestyle audit. We want to know where governors have gotten this money that they have invested so much in a period of four years. Na hawa governors kama uparanya hako na ndeke, anaruka nayo. Iyo ndeke siku moja ni pesa ngapi? Anaruka na ndeke helikopter kila siku. Sasa amehama kaka meka, anaishi na Europe. Wewe uparanya tulukucha kuwa kaka meka ukaya wapi? Kaka meka! Kama hamutaki devolution museme to root central government mamba devolution to toe. COG is unconstitutional, it is amorphous, it is something that's being used to steal money from counties. In fact, wacha ni kuambia wabila wanafanya. Kuna hile pesa ambao wameseme iwe kienda COG. What is happening, governors are adding more. If it is supposed to take 20 million, wanachukua 30 million. Iyo 10 million yao wanaongaya na Jacqueline Mokeni, wanaenda wanachukua. That is what they are doing. Na tunataka audit general to audit COG. Tujue pesa ngapi inakuja huko na inafanya kasi gani. Na hiyo COG haiko kwa katipa ya Kenya. Sisi tulifanya devolved government system. Na wakasema sisi tuko devolved. Tuka kuja kwa counties. Mbono wanataka kutisha sisi Nairobi. Sisi tumewambia tunataka kukua kwa counties vile wale tutupa huku. Sasa wameona majeshi ya counties hiko na nguvu hata kuliko panyako. Sasa wameokopa nyinyi wanarudi Nairobi. Sina mna hiyo? Sina mna hiyo! Situlisema wa ingeji nyinyi? Yee! Kwanu wanakuja Nairobi, hii counties zote siku Nairobi? Habana! Wawache Nairobi, mwishinuwa uhuru kinyata, adili na acheshi, adili na polisi, adili, ajana nana? Nanae! Kwa sababu hawa ni watu wako divo? Divo. Na walithania hati wana devolve sisi Ndiyo tupikwa na governors Governors wajue tuko na ngufu kuliko hao We are the hospital We are the hospital Tumeondoka, zimefungwa ama zijafungwa Zimefungwa Kwa hayo mengi, ningependa kusema Sita ongea kupita hapa Kwa sababu kutoka hapa, tunataka tukipea hapa hali ingine Tena Asandeni, hiko suwali First of all, I've said from the beginning that I am not in a position to answer to the president. Because the president, if I answer to the president, I'll be politicizing issues of workers. Uh, the, the workers deal with the employers. And you and me know who are the employers within the public sector. We have the Public Service Commission employing nurses within the national government. And we have the county public service boards employing nurses within the county government. And therefore, I cannot re respond to the president. But I want to tell you there's no nurse who has been arrested. We have had demonstration on Thursday. We had very successful demonstration today is Monday. Last week on Thursday, we had very successful demonstration in Embu, and we did not see any arrests being done. So we know the provision of the Constitution of Kenya was that six of freedom of assembly, and we know the right under Article 37 about picketing demonstration when you are unarmed, and even uh, presenting to government uh, petition from the public. So we, we, we are not scared about anything. And, uh, but I've told my members to take precautions. If you don't have to be outside there, don't find, find, find yourself next to a hospital. Uh, so that they say you have gone to prevent anyone from working. If they are cowards and they are home guards, they want to work, let them work. They are home guards, isn't you? Yeah. There are other methods we can use to deal with the people. Because we are a trade unionist and we know the method we can use. But we cannot go to a hospital and stand by the gate and block people from entering. The, you have a right to go on strike and you have a right not to go on strike. We cannot force anybody. So we will not be having any nurse arrested unless you are being removed from your house. Yes. Thank you. Asante. Kama hakuna mengine.